this is my graphite magnesium single cell. Um, the graphite is water soluble graphite in the form of art pencils. Two of those wrapped in car chamois, which is a treated type of leather, highly absorbent. I then have magnesium ribbon wrapped around the chamois, another layer of chamois, some more magnesium ribbon and chamois to finish it off. I've wet it down with tap water, which is quite pure here, um, straight out of the lake. So salt water would probably give me a better output. I'm running it through a jewel thief with a two inch toroid. It's by Philoound with a pretty thick gauge. I can't remember, it's probably around 18, 20. Uh, the transistor is a 2N2222 with a 1K ohm resistor coming off the base. Uh, and powering that again is the single cell graphite magnesium and I'm getting around 1.8 to 1.9 volts out of this cell which is probably the most I've gotten out of any of my cells so I'll just hook this up and show you the output uh, one hand is a little difficult there you go that's my lead torch uh, and that's the output from uh, the single cell. I thought that was pretty impressive for just one cell. Lights up my torch pretty good. So I'll probably uh, put some secondary windings on that toroid and see if I can't get my uh, little uh, pulse motor running. A little uh, one magnet, no bearing pulse motor. And I've got a, a single lead here that I'll test, and it should be fairly bright as well. Yeah, that's a single lead, so it's getting a fairly good brightness out of that. And I was pretty impressed for just a single cell. There you go.